Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Laura, and today is St. Patty's Day, so I will wish, wish everybody a happy St. Patty's Day if you celebrate. Uh, I am making um, corned beef and cabbage in the crock pot for today. I am wearing my green shirt, and today I figured I would do a video about green. So I am going to do 10 books that I own on my shelf that are green, have green covers. So I'm just going to do... These are books that I haven't actually read yet, and I haven't read any of these yet, uh, except I'm in the middle of reading one now, and uh, one I started a long time ago. So um, um, I don't know anything about these books. I'm just going to show you the covers, and t they're green. So, so 10 books, so let's get going. The first book actually has the word green in it, and it is the third book of a series. Uh, of the Ruby Red series trilogy and this is called Emerald Green and look how pretty that cover is that's green yes I own all three books and I have not read it yet so that's the first one and the second book that I picked off my shelf was uh, The Runaway King and I think that this is book two of The False Prince so it says the sequel so look how pretty that one is nice and green so, um, this is a, a, a young adult. <clears throat> the next book is an adult book that I picked off my shelf, and it has lots of green on it. It's called The Time Traveler's Life by Audrey Nif Niffenager. So, that has lots of green in it. Okay, and the next book I took off my nonfiction shelf and this is a author that I used to listen to on podcast a lot. And um, I actually have a book. I don't think I actually read the full book of this. I did probably start it. Um, but I haven't read the full thing. But I own the book. And it's called 10 Stu Stupid Things Couples Do to Mess Up Their Relationships. And it's by Dr. Laura Sch Schlesinger. Um, I um, listened to her her on audio and because her name is Laura and my name is Laura so um, I was listening to her a long time um, maybe about 10 years ago or so and I picked up her book and I have it on my shelf and it's nice and green look at all that green on there so uh, that was that stuck out when I looked at my shelf I'm like oh there's a green one in my nonfiction books so <laughs> Um, the next book is a middle grade book, and this one I actually started with Justin, and I am uh, about 100 pages in, 115 pages in, and no, I did not finish it, but we did watch the movie already, and it is The Lightning Thief. Um, I do want to eventually read this book, uh, because I own them all, and I've been collecting all his um, books, so hopefully... One day I will pick it up and actually complete this. So that's on my to-do list. Um, the next book is an adult book as well. And it is called Still Missing by Chevy Stevens. And look how pretty that cover is. It has like some glass on it. And that's pretty cool. <clears throat> okay, the next book is actually an author that I met um, at Barnes & Noble. And she signed it. And the name of the book is Anatomy of the Fit Misfit. Um, but I haven't read the book yet. So I did meet the author and I do and she did sign it. Let's see if I can find it. If she signed it. I think she signed it to the triplets. Let's see. Um, yep, to the triplets. Because all my books will eventually go to the triplets. So she signed it to the triplets. And it says, thanks so much for coming out. Hope you enjoy my novel. And she wrote her name on the back, on the bottom. So, And that was this one. Okay. And the next book is also, um, this one is a an adult book. It's called Necessary Lies by Diane Chamberlain. And that's a nice green cover. <clears throat> Uh, the next book has a lot of green and a little bit of red in it. It's Memories of an Imaginary Friend. And I think that this is adult as well, but I'm not sure. Actually, the quote on the top is from Jody Bacolt. And this is by Matthew Dix. So, um, this is this one. I'm not imaginary. So, that's what it says on the back. So... 
And the last book is a book that I'm currently reading, and I think you probably already know and can guess it. I am reading this because the movie is coming out on Friday, and um, trying to read this, I am at 100, 220 pages, so I am trying to get through this book. It is Insurgent, and look how pretty that cover is. So nice and pretty. This is by, by Veronica Roth, and the, and the movie is coming out on Friday. So um, Divergent was my favorite book of last year. Um, and I watched the movie twice. I watched it once in the theater and then I rented it and I let the girls watch it. Justin wasn't involved. He didn't want to see it. Um, so, um, I am trying to read book two and because the movie's coming out and I think I probably will only bring my girls because Justin didn't see Divergence. So, um, I might bring my girls to see the movie and it'll be a nice day out with them. So, Anyway, these are the nice, the 10 books that I pulled off my shelf that are green in cover. Look how pretty that is. Nice and green. So, <clears throat> anyway, thank you for watching and have a safe, happy St. Patty's Day. Bye!